When good news gets better, I get excited. And it seems like week after week after week, we're getting more Mafia news. Uh, this is going to be a very short video, just so you're aware. But if you are joining me for the first time uh, and you like what you hear, why not consider hitting the thumbs up and subscribe buttons because that's always awesome for you and me. Uh, if you're coming back, thank you so much for returning. It is always awesome to hang out. I'm not wasting your time. Let's dive in. Mafia. The game that has basically been ramping up a bit of its activity lately because there is awesomeness due out later this year. The series that is re-releasing part 1 and 2 has announced that the very first game uh, will be getting a physical release. Now, I should also mention that these games are going to be released at, I believe, full price, which is fine for the original game. I understand that. They put a lot of work into it. Not so sure about the remaster of Part 2 getting that, but, uh, you know, what are you going to do? That's that's what it is, if that's what they've decided from what I know so far. The thing that I am most excited about uh, is the fact that, at least, you know, the first game, the first game is going to get a physical release, and uh, a physical copy will come out. Now, the artwork that appears that you can see right there, uh, so far isn't what I would call the the greatest choice for a remake cover I wouldn't even call that the greatest choice for a mafia game cover personally I honestly think that it can be so much better I do I think that they could put a bit more attention to detail in that maybe that's one of those ones that's a tentative cover for the time being but at least I'm excited to know that not only are we getting games uh, at full price which I wouldn't normally be excited about um, but uh, that fact that they're putting it out at such a high price generally should mean uh, and I believe that it will mean that we're going to get a quality game, okay? Considering that the base product, the, the original Mafia from 2002 was a groundbreaking, phenomenal game. If you haven't played that, I recommend it. Go and check it out at the present time. You probably could pick it up pretty cheap. You might want to, you know, get it on the PS2. I don't know how you're going to play it, but I recommend playing it. Try it out. Download it if you need to, but do it legally, of course. That's I, I wouldn't recommend uh, anything else. Uh, it also means, by the way, that for people like me, that, that this idea of having a physical release, uh, we're going to be able to have a tangible item that we get to hold uh, and play just like, you know, the days of the original game and... Look, I know that there's a lot of people out there that love the games going to be on the digital platform because it is easier, I have to admit this, okay, to have all of your games playable at basically the press of a button, you don't have to get up, you don't have to change the disc, you don't have to move around, you just get up and that's it, you've got your game, push a button, ding dong boom, done, okay, uh, and you don't have to worry about having a physical copy, but me, personally, I love being able to hold a physical copy, a cover in my hand, I don't know what it is, it just feels better, and I don't, I, you know, I love knowing that I have the disc, I paid full price for a disc, a cover, and the game itself, um, especially for, you know what, is basically a classic game, to be able to have that and hold it as a remaster, right next to, I have the original, uh, a, a PC version, sort of like a mini, a, a box version, I love it, I, if I could play it on my uh, Mac, I would, I can't, unfortunately, but I love the idea that I'm going to be able to get a physical release of Mafia 1. Uh, at the present time, though, I, it should be noted that Mafia 2 definitely isn't getting a uh, physical release at the present time. Maybe if there's enough of a clamor or yammer or yelling for this, they might consider putting it out onto physical, the uh, Mafia 2 remaster. But I doubt that that's going to happen at this point in time, which is, to be fair with you, it's kind of annoying. Uh, I think if they're going to remaster and then re-release -re and remake, then do it for both of the games. I understand not putting out the third one again, because I believe they're going to make that as a, a one whole collection where you get everything. I get that. Okay, that was already released for the PS4. But the first two games were not, so maybe put out both of them as a physical copy for people like me, who like to collect all and have them all looking like nice and neat and beautiful as a physical package. Um... But look, I get that companies are choosing to invest more in the digital age. Uh, in terms of profit, I understand that. I don't like it, but I definitely get it, okay? Like I said, though, uh, I'm not going to take up too much of your time. This is a short video. Really, it's just an update about the fact that Mafia 1 will be getting a physical release. So if you're a fan of the Mafia games, if you're not a fan of the Mafia games, if you're a fan of gangster games in general, then this should be a game that you look out for. Go and, uh, when it does come out later this year, check it out, pick it up, try it. I recommend it. Uh, it is definitely one of those games that uh, will hook you from, I feel like, the get-go. Maybe what I remember was just something different. Um, but hey, check the game out when it does come out, or check out reviews. You may not like it straight away. But if you did enjoy this video, then uh, why not click the thumbs up button, the subscribe button. Um, you know, th th those buttons are def definitely awesome if you were to press them. Uh, and if you are returning, then it is awesome as always to have you back. Thank you for ha coming back. Uh, and I'm glad that we could actually hang out again. Thank you, honestly. Um, and I hope to see you in the next video. Uh, for now, though, bye.